so hi guys uh, in this video as you might have read in the title that i have uh, made three h pumps i mean not three but uh, two h pumps so i'll show you what they are so the h pump i use currently is this one and yeah I use this one uh, so I'll tell you what uh, that H perm was on later but I created two more H perm so the first one I created is this one with a U prime at the end I mean a U so I can't do it with my left hand like that well like I have to push it over here or I have to put my hand over here like that but yeah I can't do it with my left hand that well so I don't use this H perm uh, and now this is the third H perm and this also has a uh, U at the end and it like all of these three H perms work as well like work as a normal H perm, uh, and like the H perm I use is like the normal one, but I just made two more H perm just in case I forget. So yeah, so I'll just put a chart on the screen telling you which H perm uh, is which, and I'll put uh, things like H perm number one is this, and H perm number two is this and H perm number 3 is this so yeah I'll just put it up right now so now uh, you know the chart and I'll tell you what H perm number 1 is so H perm number 1 is this So that was H perm number one, uh, which I'll tell you the algorithm on the screen so you can match it with the one on the chart. Okay, now this is H perm number two. So this is H perm number two. Uh, you might have seen it on the screen. And now you can match it with the chart and see what H for number two is. Now this will be H for number three. Okay, yeah. That was H for number three, and now you can match it on the chart. But like, yeah, you'll know what it is because this is the last H, last H perm. And yeah, uh, these H perm work like really well. Uh, you can use any of them uh, to do a H perm. And yeah, the M prime moves are these ones where you uh, use your ring finger and then you just push like the middle layer up like this I'll show you so this is my ring finger hope you can see and then I just push the middle layer up and the M moves are like this where you use your middle finger I mean your ring finger to push the middle layers like down yeah okay so now that you know all the h perms i will uh do all the h perms on this cube over here and tell you which is the fastest but like if you want to use one h perm that's not 
quite fast you can but yeah so uh this stage from number one and now i'll do h prime number two Uh, I don't know how to do that quite well, so yeah. Now I'll do H for number 3. So. So, uh, in conclusion, the H perm I prefer is H for number 1. Um, that's what I use. But. I'll tell you the speed of, uh, of the fastest h perm, like in my opinion. In my opinion, h perm number one is really fast. And uh, h perm number two is uh, the slowest. Um, and h for number three is the second fastest so like yeah and i think h for number uh, three is like second place in speed because you just do m2 in u primes and then at the end you just do m2 and u so that's quite fast and uh in h4 number two you do m2 u2 m2 u prime m2 u2 m2 u so yeah that's kind of slow for me um i don't know about you but yeah and in H4 number 3, you just do M2, U prime, M2, U2, M2, U prime, M2. That's like the uh, move efficient H perm where you save a lot of moves. But yeah, that's why I think it's the fastest. But I usually do M2 with one finger like this. I just push really hard. And that's M2. And I have like the strongest practice on this cube, which helps me hold the pieces. And yeah, that was it for this video. Hope you liked it. And if you liked it, leave a like. And if you want, you can subscribe to my channel, Ian Play. But now, goodbye.